I'm Joy Book Tomas and I am sitting here at my dining room table in my house coat. I'm dressed, but I'm in my house coat. I'm feeling a little blah. I'm feeling a little blue. It's sort of gray outside. It's not the perfect weather. It was a little sunnier this morning. Um, I just have some questions for you because I know that I've got a lot of things that I want to talk about, but my brain is sort of like, what do you want to hear about? And I know it seems like really, really strange, but I'm just going to be really raw and really real. I know that if you're anything like me, sometimes you just get down and blah and you might notice that things are not exactly how they should be. You know, you know, you realize that you're shaking because I've been shaking for a while. I can actually see it when I'm recording this. Um, but I'm, I'm not a hundred percent. And I know that I'm not a hundred percent. I don't remember the last time that I washed my hair, which means I need to do that. Um, I know I didn't do it since I got these nails done because I got these nails done because I wanted to do some you know, fancy videos, but I haven't felt like doing fancy videos. I haven't felt like getting all dolled up. So I'm just going to be coming to you real and raw. And this is how I am. And, um, you know, I want to tell you my story. I want to tell you more about me. I want you to get to know me. Um, but at the same time, my brain is like, what do you want me to talk about? Um, and I, you know, I've got some things I want to talk about. I want to, you know, talk about, you know, what does it feel like when you don't remember when you washed your hair? What does it feel like, you know, when you're just like, I need to take care of myself. I need to rest. I need to get more sleep. <sighs> I need to not want to cry. Um, and some things make me cry. I was reading... Uh, a status of someone and uh, I haven't seen her for years I met her at an event years and years and years ago and I didn't realize it I thought she was talking about maybe her son or someone in her family uh, but it sounds like her husband is suicidal and uh, I I know that feeling I know what it's like to want to end your life I know what it's like to feel really sad and depressed and not wanting to live anymore. And I think it's really hard for me to hear that other people are going through that. And I know that we all have our own journey. We all have our own things that we have to go through. But I'm really sad. Um... Because reading that made me sad. Because I remember that. I remember how I was. I remember how... And I know I'm crying. I feel like really embarrassed that I'm crying. But this is me. Um, I need to do a video on telling you my story. But you might get my story as, as it goes. <laughs> and just how it goes with everything. Um, yeah. Yeah. I need to take care of myself more and um, and I want to document, I want to document this journey. I want to document this journey to finding joy, finding myself and finding joy in life. Uh, and I know what it's like to feel sad. Um, I know what it's like to be on antidepressants for years and years and years. And that was the only way I could be able to function. But I felt like a zombie and um, I knew that something needed to be changed. <sighs> Anyways, I'll talk about my story later. Um, I just wanted to hop on and do a really quick video um, and tell you that if you're having those sad feelings, you're not alone and uh, that there is a way to find some joy in your life. Um, you don't have to feel blue. You don't have to, you know, feeling blue and feeling sad, feeling lonely, feeling depressed. All of those things, they happen. They happen to the best of us. Anyways, I will talk to you soon. Um, 
please comment on this video. Tell me one thing that you do to bring some joy into your life. Just one thing. Is there something that you do to bring some joy? I, um, I'm going to take some time for me. And sometimes that means going into a hot tub, you know, just a bath hot tub or a hot tub if you have the jacuzzi kind of style hot tub. Um, but, you know, taking a bath, taking a warm bath, lighting up some candles or, you know, taking some Epsom salts. I take some Epsom salts and I put some of doTERRA's essential oils in them. Um, be aware of what type of essential oils you use, but I use doTERRA and they work for me. And, um, I just put some doTERRA essential oils into some Epsom salts and mix it up. And then I put them into my bath water. Um, yeah, comment below if you want the recipe. I have some fantastic recipes. All right. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.